Hey there friends and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming, I'm Brianna White and today we're going to be playing some more Final Fantasy VII Remake, this episode featuring our favorite girl Aerith because we just got her in our party. It's really exciting, this episode's going to be awesome, you're going to love it, but first, since you're all PlayStation fans already, I thought I'd thank today's video sponsor, PlayStation. How cool is that? They're doing this really cool thing called Days of Play that I'm really excited about and you've probably already heard about because of their amazing discounts on games. Games we know and love, like Ghost of Tsushima, Spider-Man Miles Morales, and The Last of Us Part Two, for only $29.99. It's pretty exciting. We here at SRG are all about community events. Well, PlayStation is too. The PlayStation Player Celebration is all about community. Step one, sign up. Step two, play video games. Step three, profit. Well, in this case, win rewards. And since you're playing video games already, it's kind of a no-brainer. Play solo, play with friends, or earn trophies, all to help reach a community goal and unlock exclusive rewards like PSN avatars or PS4 themes. And there's also a stretch goal to win bonus rewards, which are really cool and I really want them and I can't unlock them alone. So there's a link in the description. All I had to do was sign into my account, click sign up, and it was that easy. It was like two clicks. But remember your playtime will only count and you'll only get the super awesome rewards if you sign up. So click the link in the description below, support those who support this channel, in this case, PlayStation. Thank you so much, PlayStation, for sponsoring today's video. I am so excited about Days of Play. This is a super, super cool community event. And now, on to the gameplay video. Enjoy. Hey, my house is this way. I know, Aerith. I know exactly where your house is. But what are you gonna tell me if I once again try to explore? Over here. Looking for something? Yeah, I'm always looking for something. Over here. Go for it! All right, okay. Look it! They make their own produce. That's nice. Is there something in here? Doesn't look like it. Oh, I can go in here. Cool. It's in here. Hey, my house is this way. I know! I just want to explore, Aerith. Ooh, it's a good thing I wandered in here, isn't it? Nourish your heart. I need nourishment for my heart and my body. Stop thinking of food so much. It's almost dinner time and I'm hungry. What are all these kids just standing in here for? <laughs> Bet you didn't know that the smell of flowers helps nourish your heart. I need nourishment for my heart and my body. Okay, if they keep talking about food, I'm gonna get so hungry. Uh, what else do you have to say while we're here? Hmm, what decorations should we put up next? So, are you a friend of Aerith's? Thanks so much, Aerith. Okay, Aerith came and caught up with us. Yeah. Get rid of that stool. So, Cloud, what's your favorite flower? They're all the same to me. Huh. You sure you want to say that to a florist? Better than lying. Okay. Then what'd you do with the flower I gave you? I, uh... You give it away? I did. Ooh, to who? Tell me. Don't recall. Hmm? What? Thought you didn't like lying. <laughs> well, anyway. She always catches him. Always. <clears throat> <laughs> Nothing escapes Aerith. Nothing. My house is just up this path. Mom should be home by now, so I'll introduce you. Oh, I can hear that I was a little uh, sinusy during that line. Did you guys hear that? Or am I just hearing that because it's my own voice? Or maybe, it's so interesting. Sometimes I wonder if I actually hear it in my own voice or if I'm actually remembering recording that line with a little bit of sinusy. It's good that you couldn't hear it, for real, but <clears throat> 
that's the thing about it is sometimes you have to work when you're sick and you got to make it sound good and that was really really challenging <clears throat> there you go that's my house it's amazing <laughs> Hey, my house is this way. I'm so excited to see this. I haven't seen it yet. Isn't it amazing that all of Midgar, especially the slums, is just metal and rust? But here, it's just overflowing with life. It's beautiful. I didn't watch, I didn't look at any of the screens when they came out, so. This is really exciting. Look at all these different flowers. So pretty. Why do these also kind of look like all the same flowers in Animal Crossing? Right though? Like the red one could be hyacinth. The, uh, the yellow one could be Cosmos, the orange ones could be Mums. <laughs> they all kind of, they all kind of look like the Animal Crossing flowers. <laughs> Come on! Oh, the music, it's so good! I'm home! Hey, baby! Been up to no good? Rude came by. So, this is my mom, Elmira. And this is Cloud, my bodyguard. Uh, hi. Take good care of her? That's my job. Or was my job. Yep, thanks. So, Cloud, you gonna head back to Sector 7? Yeah. Then I'll show you the way. Then why'd you have me bring you here? What if the Turks show up again? It'd suck, but I've dealt with them before. Honestly, I'm much more worried about you. What if you get lost, huh? You'd be too embarrassed to admit it, and so you'd just keep on going. Quit acting like you know me. Hey, Mom. I'm gonna go take Cloud over to Sector 7, okay? <sighs> okay. But why not wait until tomorrow? If you head out now, it'll be dark when you get back. Better to rest up here and make the trip first thing in the morning. When you'll have daylight to spare. That's true. She's got a point, Cloud. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, yeah. I still need to deliver some flowers to the leaf house. Since we have a little time before dinner, you should come with. That wasn't the deal. You mean you want more? Even though you've got a priceless reward coming your way, <laughs> do you know what I promised him? I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go grab the baskets. Be right back. <sighs> that Aerith. She's a handful, isn't she? That Aerith. She's a handful. So, I specifically remember reading the script and thinking, wait a minute, they just got to Aerith's house. And now they're going to turn around and go back? <laughs> and, uh... I, I can't say too much more, but... It just... it The whole thing is very funny. That Aerith enlists Cloud to be her bodyguard to get her home. He does that, and then she says, Oh, well, you'll need an escort if you're going to go anywhere else, so that they can keep adventuring together. So... All of that's just very cute. And then also in that scene, you have Aerith about to tell her mom, well, I promised him I'd go on a date with him. And then Cloud's like, no, 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 no. Don't tell her that. That's embarrassing. I'll do it. I'll do it. <laughs> all of that. All of that is just so good. It's, it's one of the more casual best scenes in the game, in my opinion. There's just pictures of nature everywhere. Who takes a picture of the scenery directly in their backyard? 
and uses that as decor for their house. Like, that's what the windows do. <laughs> Who decided this decoration? <laughs> I love it here. Some ivy, some crystals. Wow, this is just like my house. I love it. An old TV. Ooh, some tango pictures. A cat. I love everything in here. Are we gonna talk to Elmira? What are these? Coconuts? Oh, they're onions. <laughs> I'm like, what are these coconuts doing here? <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> and a pumpkin. Couple dirty dishes, some spices, I'm guessing, some herbs. I love it. I love every little thing in this house. Okay, I think we're gonna talk to Elmira before we try to go upstairs. It must be tough. No, never mind. It must be tough dealing with that sassy Aerith. It is. Hmm. 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 All right, now if we try to leave, what happens? Aerith won't be long. Yeah, she's not going to let us leave. Nervous, are we? <laughs> you going somewhere? Aerith won't be long. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Let's see what happens if we try to go upstairs. Hanging planters, I love it. A single candle. That's weird. Could have sworn I put them here. So we have two bedrooms. Aerith in here. And it looks like we can should go upstairs to explore a little bit more. Oh, there's the church flowers! You see that photo? She loves them. we get up here? Please be a sweeping view. <gasps> it's an outdoor patio. Yes! Ooh, look at all these little roof plants. Wow. Huh. <gasps> it's so pretty. Oh. I just want to soak it all up. It's so nice. Can you imagine this being your house? Ah, oh, it's amazing. It's so nice. A pumpkin patch. Wow, it's so pretty. And still, even still, in this this little uh, oasis in the the metal city, you still have the plate above your head. So interesting. Waterfall! Oh my goodness! That would probably be pretty loud, actually. All right, so now that we've done that, I guess we go back. Now, do we go... Can't interact with anything there. Can't interact with anything there. I guess we will probably get something activated when we go back downstairs. Found him! How'd I know? 
You take this one. Huh? Take it. Uh. <laughs> take the basket, Cloud. Right. Off we go. <sighs> take. And these right here A are butterflies. Oh, her babies. Look at Cloud carrying a flower basket. He's afraid to carry it normal. What a goof. Uh, she wants us to go this way, so I feel like I have to explore this way if I can. Don't yell at me, Aerith. Don't yell at me. Just want to explore. Oh, it loops back around. <laughs> Look how pretty it is. I feel like I don't want to go that way yet. I'll just follow Aerith for a little bit. Hmm. Which ones do you think we should pick? Any of them. Oh, don't be like that. I know you have an eye for this kind of thing. Ooh! Choose flowers to deliver to the leaf house. Ooh, how fun! Press triangle when you are close to a garden to pick flowers. The decorations at the leaf house change depending on the colors you select. Okay. Depending on the colors. Okay. So this is, oh, so that's why there's so many different areas that you can pick from, okay. So these are white. It's a great color. These are green. They're like little cattails. These are white, a great color. Oh, but come on, this is the classic. This is the classic color. It's it's the yellow lily. I feel like I have to go yellow lily. What does she say if I talk to her? I cannot talk to her. Oh. Okay. I feel like I have to go with the yellow lily. That's the one I gave you. Huh. It is? Nice try, mister. You can't fool me. Look at us picking flowers together. I think we still need a few more. Which should we pick next? Okay. So we can also go with white or those green cattails, or we could do, can we do the white lilies that were up there? No, we can only pick from this area right here. Well, I only see three. Are we gonna be able to pick all of them? We can't pick any of the red ones or anything. I guess we'll go white. It's nice, they're nice, and greenery is nice too, and you know, when you're building a bouquet, you wanna have a statement flower, but then you also wanna have some understated greenery as filler. But if we're only going to get the option to pick from these three flowers, I think we have to make it two flowers and not just some some greenery. It's always good to have some, some height in a nice bouquet as a gift, but I still think we're gonna go with the white flowers here. Good eye. People used to give these to declare their loyalty to one another. Interesting, right? Oh man, I think I'm remembering the she voice said, line. As many as you can carry, so maybe a few more? Okay, so wait a minute. So could we pick one of each? Or it looks like we could go back and fill with more of the yellow. But I think, I think I know the voice line if you pick these. So I'm gonna try and pick these and see if she says it. Whoa, foxtails, huh? 
I gotta hand it to you. I never would have thought of that. It'll definitely take them by surprise. I always felt when I first read it that that was Aerith's way of being like, I think we're good. Boxtails? What do you say? That's terrible Shall we for go? a bouquet. It's not exactly what I would have chosen, but okay, Cloud. We'll 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 compliment your creativity here. <laughs> okay, I'm glad. I'm glad I picked that. Okay. I'm glad I remembered that. Sometimes I don't remember the lines, but I remember that one. Okay, so now I think we go back here. Do we go straight to the leaf house from here or Yeah, I guess we'll try and go to the leaf house now. <laughs> I like that they kind of make you walk slow. We're not under the gun or anything. I'm not cut out for this crap. Sure you are. And when you're done, you'll be drowning in job offers. <laughs> That I was just talking so, about the speed you're walking. How do you think they'll arrange these flowers? Don't know. Well, we'll soon find out. I don't mind that they make you take your time. I really don't. But also, if you were running with a bouquet in your hand, I don't think Cloud would be very graceful about it. I also find it interesting and beautiful that the whole community benefits from Aerith's oasis. Because look at how many how much greenery there is around here, which there really aren't in any other slums. I'll wait out here. Oh, okay. But I might be a while. Why not check out the town? <gasps> That's what I love to do. How did she know? <sighs> Goodbye, Aerith. Still at it. I'll miss you. Join our party again, please. Uh... All right, is it time for some exploring? Might we pick up a side quest or two? There's the white lily. Ooh, you hear that music kick in? You recognize it? It's so good. When is it gonna get dark around here? Maybe never? This here's the Sector 5 Community Center. I love that that kid just totally runs into the back of you. So this is like the YMCA of Midgar. Ooh, I get to pick the music. You know what I'm picking. Ooh, Tangle of Tears Obtained. All right. But you know I'm changing it to my favorite song. A good song. I won darts to this song. <laughs> As a matter of fact, old man, I am. Take. A vial of Celerus. Celery? Gross! What does a vial of Celerus do? Hastens whoever drinks it. All right! Super speed! I don't know what celery has to do with that. 
Those were good times. I don't know why my old man voice is always British. <laughs> Can I not do a British old man voice? Hold on. Those were good times. And then that was like SpongeBob SquarePants old man voice. Oh boy. Can I talk to you? No. Oh. What are you reaching for, kids? Oh, another child. Okay. Wait, you're wearing the same outfit! Oh, a dog! Look, they're petting the dog! I want to pet the dog. I'm really missing out not being able to pet the dog. <gasps> Take! And what did we get? A bottle of Echo Mist. That is awakening, right? Something like that. Did you know? This place is haunted. Oh, it's haunted. When rich people walk through here, their gill and jewels magically disappear. Oh, then we don't have to worry about anything. That's an odd we myth. Be prepared for war. It's coming, whether we like it or not. Well, thank you for telling me that random person know? standing in the street now what else okay so our goal is to well we already did that so our goal is just to explore a little bit Ooh, could we perchance purchase some <gasps> chadley what are you doing here chadley okay so i guess part of our mission now is going to be to to meet up with chadley our dear friend from Sector 7. What is he doing in Sector 5? Following us? I just love the smell of that new fabric softener. Oh, I know the one. It's Chocobo scented. Chocobo scented fabric softener? No! No! Just imagine if your fabric softener was chicken scented. No! Ugh! Horrified. I remember you. Oh! Where's Eric? The Leaf House. Bye. Nice meeting you, Oats. What a name. Oats. Now, where are we headed? Okay, we could definitely go this way. I could abide such a thing. Aerith the fifth cafe. Oh, Aerith is a sweetheart. Aerith, that's the secret. Really? Where can I find them? Someone at the Leaf House might know. Aerith is such a sweetheart. She is. Exactly. I agree. I'd recommend Costa del Sol anywhere else. According to the Those avalanche guys are unbelievable. Without the reactors, how are we supposed to live? We need to stand up and fight. They can't be surprised to destroy our way over. Oh, it's so interesting trying to listen to all of the dialogue, you know? Because there's a lot of it. Ooh. Well, hey there. Okay, now what do we have here? We've got some options here. Now, what have we equipped Aerith with? Aerith came with this, right? But we thought maybe it would be better if we balanced her a little bit more. So... Ooh, that's kind of tough. I love a good balance here. I do. And it still has... It, well, why is anyone wearing leather when they could wear titanium? Which has... Yeah, okay, so instead of leather, everyone should be wearing titanium. So what are we equipped with right now? I didn't buy any of your equipment, sir. Not yet. Okay. Titanium, iron, leather, mithril, titanium. Okay. So I think we should probably switch out Tifa's leather 
for titanium. Yes, for sure, because it only minuses one defense, but it adds 19 magic defense, which I like. I like the idea of that. If you don't look so out we're going to go ahead no one and else that. will. That's a lesson for life from the ground. So many life lessons from the ground floor. Oh, but it is expensive. Let's make sure there's nothing else we want. Star pendant soothes the wearer in mysterious ways. Becomes immune to poison? Meh. Yeah, I think we'll just spend all the gill on titanium bangle. I think it'll be worth it. We might find a titanium bagel and then really regret that. I didn't sell anything. What will it be for you today? If I have anything to sell, I don't know if I do. Sell. So, this isn't worth any. We do have a ton of grenades that we never use, so we'll just sell a little bit of those. And that, you know, didn't get us anything really. Uh, the big bombers are only worth one gill? I'm supposed to use them? Lame. Okay, so since we don't like the star bracelet, I think we're gonna get rid of those. They're not worth much, but they're also worthless just sitting in our inventory, so goodbye. Iron bangle, no one's wearing that but Barret. This is all the non-equipped stuff, okay? I don't like Mesmeric Armlet, just because we, we want to keep it, we want to hold on to it, but I don't like unbalanced defense. Unless I'm equipping it for a very specific fight. Which right now I'm not. So we'll just hold on to a little bit of everything there. What about Materia? We have a lot of lightning materia, and we don't need all that. We'll keep two. I like keeping two. We'll keep the MP up. Yeah, and we'll keep the rest. All right. Not bad. Not Got a bad what haul. You need to stay safe? Hey, and then we can actually just go in and switch out Tifa's, even though she's technically not in our party right now. It's game magic. And then, oh, but it didn't let us automatically switch out the Materia, which is strange. Oh, unless we had just taken Materia from her. Well, now we need to make sure we Materia her up. So what is she gonna need? Um, yeah. What about... What about... Lightning or healing? We'll go with lightning. She already has healing materia. Okay. It'll be fine. What's this way? Anything interesting? Oh, a dead end! You know what that means? The most interesting uh, thing. I oh. can't leave without telling her. Oh, a rare little moment for Cloud. He's got a sense of honor, and he wouldn't just want to sneak away. I love that because th those moments are so few and far between. Because normally Cloud is just calling everyone around him an idiot. You know. Hmm. Hmm. Yes, I'd like to buy some items. Oh, look at how many high potions I can buy. Uh, I love high potions. Uh, I just want to buy them all. What else do you sell? We also have to go to the weapon shop too, so... Uh, let's, let's wait on that for a minute. Later. Wow, you are not a friendly shopkeep. F customer service. No, -uh. no grown-ups allowed. Do you know what I could unleash if I wanted to get through there, young children? All right, as long as we're clear. Ooh, a silver ticket. 
Ooh, some Willy Wonka stuff in there. Okay. Let's see. Now, is that also going to yell at me if I try to go this way? Let's find out. Yep. Uh, I can't leave without telling her. Yep. Uh, Chadley! Let's go. Chadley! Chadley! Hello! I understand you must be busy, but I hope you haven't forgotten about my research. I haven't. And as a matter of fact, I have good news for you. I've completed this research. Okay. Ooh, this is... Ooh, these are new. Okay. ATB boost. I love that idea. I will buy that. And first strike increases how full it is at the start of the battle. I don't love it. I'm not going to say I don't want it. I just am going to say I don't love it. All right, Chadley. Cloud. Thank you. I've come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? Yes, please, Chadley. Cloud, I have the most amazing news. Yes, you've mentioned. I believe I might know how to develop summoning materia. Something heretofore thought impossible. Scientists say that this materia can only be found in nature, but I may just be able to prove otherwise. And so, Cloud, I turn to you. And so, Cloud. I'd like Cloud. to test this theory by way of my combat simulator. To wit, I want you to fight and defeat summon data in VR. I sense that you find my phrasing to be somewhat obtuse. It's so funny. Chadley's dialogue is written like an old man, but he's got this very childlike voice. Okay, Chadley has summoned a new combat simulator, VR missions. As you gather more and more battle intel, special missions allowing you to battle summons will, became, will become available. Oh! -ho. So if you want to have a Shiva summon, you must first battle Shiva. I love that! Please let me know when you've made your preparations. Okay. So... Oh, wow! <laughs> so all of these were unlocked, and already we've gotten three of them done. So... Let's see. Okay, so I need to defeat monsters of three unique varieties, monster variants, and combat simulation Shiva. Uh, I'm a little bit concerned that perhaps I will get my butt kicked if I try to defeat Shiva right now. But we'll talk to Chadley anyway. Oh, yeah. And what's with the bitching? I have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help. And I have to tell you you're welcome. Look at all this research I've completed. I've done it. I've developed a new materia. I've got it. I've developed a new materia. So look at all this cool materia we have now. Steel materia. We can steal things, which is really cool, and I definitely want to equip that. Provoke is probably a tanky sort of thing for Barret. Temporarily draw the enemy's attention when teammates are severely injured, ineffective against powerful enemies. But you cannot be controlling the character. Good, because I do not control Barret ever. Further decreases enemy damage and fills the ATB faster when guarding. Ugh, lame, I hate guarding. I look forward no guarding. to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Okay. So there's a new battle intel. No, not nothing new. We just still have to do one monster variant. Okay. Cool. I think, uh, all I really want right now is to get Aerith back in my party and do more Aerith stuff. So I don't really want to spend a lot of time trying on a Shiva battle right now. 
What I really want is just to... Ooh, a bench. My best friend, Bench. What I really want is to just get Aerith back in my party. So we're, we're gonna focus on Aerith stuff. Okay, sir. Okay, so we went to that, Chadley. Did we do this shop? No. Okay. So let's see what this shop I've got has the to offer. Collection of materia you'll find anywhere. The finest collection of materia? Well, Chadley is literally right outside your shop. Hawk in your sales. So. Costa del Sol. Do we have this? No, we don't. Take? Healing, cleansing, fire, ice, lightning, poison barrier, HP up, MP up. Wow. I don't know if I'd call this the finest selection of materia. I think I would call it a very common selection of materia. I think that's what I'd call it, sir. Come back anytime. Oh, I won't. You can be assured of that. I'm going to go spend all my money with this unfriendly shopkeep on high potions. I don't have all day. F minus in customer service, ma'am. I think I don't want to completely bankrupt us, so we'll just go with six high potions, and that feels just about right. That feels about right. See ya. Bye! Okay, so now that we've explored quite a bit, we've gone that way, got yelled at. We've gone this way, got yelled at. Oh, this was the weapon shop, weapons and equipment. Did I even see any weapons in the store, though? I feel like I didn't. Let's go back. Was there another weapons person right beside him? Are you separate? He's the same guy. So where's the weapons? All he had was was armor. Lame. Take care of my equipment, you hear? All I wanted was weapons, you know? Okay, so then what else? We went this way, we went this way, we explored this area. We haven't gone through this path. I think it's time probably to go back to Aaron. Our girl. But we'll go through this way because we haven't done so yet. Well, that was exciting. And, oh, what's going on here? It's oats! Is something wrong? You could say that. Sounds like someone spooked the kids. Yeah, two of them disappeared. They ran away after this creepy guy wearing black clothes showed up. A Turk? That's what I thought, but no. It's this guy who's always stumbling around town in a dirty robe full of holes. Does he have a they number on his arm? Sick or something. Oh, and he had some kind of number tattooed on his arm. There's a number on his arm. I don't arm. like the sound of this. I'm gonna check it out. I know someone who fits that description. I'll come with. Okay. Come on. Yay, Aerith's back in the party! And Oats is gonna show us the way. Fabulous. Oh, they wanna grow up to be just like Jesse. Like Jesse. What's happening? No. The single adult supervising 500 children in the Sector 5 slums is like, no. Children, no. No, it's much too dangerous. But I have to climb up there so people will like me. Will he bite me? Hi, dog. Bye, dog. Lead the way, Oats. Hi, Chadley. Bye, Chadley. <gasps> Look, I'm gonna go inside the hideout. Come on, I know this, this is, is off limits to grown-ups, but if we want to rescue them, well, we gotta break the rules. Just like a rebel does, we gotta break the rules. We're rebels after all. 
This is giving me um, Majora's Mask vibes, like going into the kids' hideout. I'm like, do I have to find five kids around the map first to get the passcode? And yes, I was thinking, as soon as I read that line while recording it, I thought, Aerith's a rebel. And I've been waiting for this moment to share that with you all. Yeah, it's true. Oats! Oh! You're back! Aerith's come to help. Yeah, leave it to us. We'll take care of it from here. But there are monsters out there. Uh, Don't yeah. Don't worry. I've got a bodyguard. I've brought a super strong friend along with me. I used to be a soldier. So where's the guy? I don't know. He disappeared and we can't find him. Right now, let's worry about the kids. Come on. Look at this cute little children jungle gym. I love it. Oh, she's got a flower. Uh -huh. Pretty flower. Pretty blue flower. Blue? Won't you talk to me? It's... Wait a minute. There's a, a lack of communication there. Uh. I'll just I'll just tell you all I, I didn't record that line. Okay. Um. You guys have got to hurry and find our friends, okay? Can we go up this way? No. Okay. I wish I had a cool jungle gym like this when I was a kid. I can't. They ran off this way. Be careful. Okay, Oats. <sighs> Where do you think they went? Who knows? Battle music. They're kids. Nothing to do but look all over. I just hope we find them in time. Ooh, I love this, like, remixed battle music. Oh, it's so good! Try to stay behind me. That was like you have your back. Fight you as Aerith! I'll show you what I can do. I'll show you what I can do. <laughs> Aha! Dodged ya! Okay, let's get some voice lines in here. We haven't tried this yet because we haven't needed it. Um... Uh, all we have is Blizzard? We gotta do something else here. Why not? Let's get serious. Ooh! Oh! It's like an it's like a floor ward. Oh, I love that. That's oh, it. that's challenging. How exciting. Have we done prey yet? I don't think we have. What? Was never in doubt. It gets me every time. I just want to hang out in ATB and clouds out there killing things and I don't get a chance to hear all the Aerith voice lines! Ugh! So upsetting. I want one thing from this game. <laughs> what happens if we just like bump into her too much? Nothing, it's not gonna let me bump into her at all. Well, that's probably for the best. Ooh, okay, some more battle here. I'm ready. Wait, though. Should maybe I equip a different materia for Aerith so we get to hear something fun? I still don't know what this means. Um... Let's switch on over to just something we have available, like lightning, just for fun. Try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back. I'm coming. <laughs> You'll see. Okay, let's use some lightning here. On the hedgehog pie that's about to pummel us. You jittery? <laughs> you jittery? I love that. Uh, let's try Soul Drain. Just a bit. 
love it. Here. Here. Oh, there's more. Wait a minute. I thought it was dead. I thought they were all dead. Oh, well, now we're in trouble, aren't we? I'm feeling pretty weak. Everything's sleeping. Oh, Aerith! I almost want to let her die just to hear what she says. But we'll, we'll be nice. There's more! They keep coming from somewhere! Oh, now he's dead. Not okay. bad. Okay. So that was lightning. Then let's switch it out again for. If we use this, we're gonna have more ATB to spend. So I think let's use that. We're not gonna get to limit break really right here. So let's get rid of that and put in, what haven't we done yet? Wind? Let's, let's throw in wind just for fun. All right, let's see what that gets us. And let's see what, ooh, boxes, smish. Let's see what happens if we go up here. Ooh, take. This is a really good game for the smashing and taking. Mega potion, yeah. I need those always. Nothing in there. Is Aerith almost dead still? Yeah, okay. Maybe just a little potion for Aerith to start the battle. Maybe just another one. There they are. And they're not alone. And they're not alone. So we're gonna wish we had thunder and uh, what are those pie monsters? Hedgehog pie monster is weak to... Are you telling me all this time and I haven't assessed them yet? What nonsense is that? Okay. So, then I'm gonna want thunder for sure. Lightning, I guess you could call it. And I'm pretty sure there's one that's higher level. I think Cloud has that one. Tifa has that one right now, okay. Let's take that from Tifa, cause Tifa's not here. All right. Yeah. And then with Cloud, Let's make sure he's got elemental fire in right now. Let's give him... Eh. Eh. I don't know, maybe fire. Uh, actually, I think the were rats and like little critters have tended to be weak to ice. So maybe we give him ice. Why not? Let's give it a shot. Try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back. Uh... How shocking. <laughs> <laughs> Are you telling me Aerith does puns? Get ready. Good night. <laughs> oh, she says good night so sweet. Where's the more rare we're at? <laughs> Uh, Cloud, there's no hedgehogs here, right? There's no hedgehogs here. Okay. So we can't assess them, so we'll go ahead and switch to Aerith using prey! I'll take care of you. Oh, I love it. Oh, that's a good ability, too. Alright, Cloud will go ahead and use some triple slash axes. Just knock them out. No problem. Glad that's over. Great! Pretty sure that was nothing in here. We came out from here. Okay, keep it going. 
Ooh, it's a hedgehog! An assess is coming for ya! Too bad. Week two, Blizzard. How did she guess? Okay. So let's switch it's to here. Aaron. So it's my turn? And we'll go ahead with. Yeah, let's go ahead and cast ourselves an arcane ward. Need more magic. <laughs> That's that. That was close. <laughs> That's that. Wait a minute. What's that vampire symbol? <laughs> How shocking. Too bright. <laughs> Quickly, we gotta save them. All right. Aerith is really concerned about these children, and I'm just really enjoying the battle. Sorry. Yeah, I feel like Aerith could use a healing materia separate from Prey, because it takes two ATB. But you know. She doesn't have the slots. If I also want to give her MP up, you know? That's the trouble I'm having. Pray, yes, definitely should have that. Magic up, yes. Maybe I should switch out the prey for, if I'm not gonna use, if I'm not gonna be able to use it ever, then what's the point, you know? So maybe let's just switch out prey right now because there's only me and Cloud, and let's switch it out for healing. What's our highest healing materia? There. Okay, cool. I'm happy with that for now. Don't overdo it. I'll take care of them. Okay. <sighs> Ooh, cloud barrier! You have one job! Come You're supposed on. to be a bodyguard! Just a little should help. Ow! <sighs> what is this? Aerith is angered? <laughs> What, what what is the status effect? Aerith is angered. <laughs> Look at the symbol down at the bottom. It's like an angry face. What is that status? <laughs> what does it mean? I'm so curious. Get him! Wow, everybody is attacking Aerith. Leave me alone. <laughs> She's going to need a lot more defense. <laughs> a lot. Oh, there's more. Okay. We're going to need to use some potions here, but we don't have ATB, which is bad. Stay back. are hitting really hard. I'm kind of surprised. Hey. Hey, cloud. Oh man, Aerith builds ATV a little slow, huh? I I just can't. My potion was stolen. That'll do. Excuse me. It what? I can't believe that. I'm feeling weak. Yeah, man, Aerith is hard to master. She just gets so intensely targeted. What can we do about that? I mean, all I can do here is just try to heal myself, and, and it's like playing catch up. Am I supposed to be dodging more often than. Oh, well! We got a limit break! What are we gonna get? Healing wind! It's perfect, it's just what we needed! Let the wind caress you. Ooh, I like that! It's perfect! Yeah, 
on, they hit so hard. So long. Man, that guy got in the way. Good night. Oh, no, no Fyra. None of that, please. Let's see. What if Cloud used Barrier on Aerith? And then Aerith used Potion on herself? Oh, no, she can use... Yeah, okay, let's just go ahead with the MP and use some Cure on herself. <laughs> oh, that's my scream! This might be it. That's so interesting. I just heard myself scream in pain. My brain is so confused right now. <laughs> My brain thinks something is wrong with me. <laughs> wow. That's weird. Just a little should help. It doesn't I'm happen all the time, weak. but it definitely happens there. There's more of you, okay. Wow, that's so wild. I was not expecting that. I thought I would be fine. Not gonna get me this time. Alright, Cloud. Cloud is silenced, okay. Potion it is. Stay back! And a heal for myself. No big deal. And a thunder for my friend over here. One more. How shocking. How shocking. That is probably my favorite. Haywire Haze. No, don't do that. That's that. That's that indeed. Not bad. Okay. Self destruct. Run! Too bright. All right. Now a little bit of a potion for Aerith. A little bit of a potion for Cloud. Nope. I guess Aerith gets another potion. That's fine. And we gotta save these kiddos. These little kidlets. One kidlet in each arm. Is he gonna just leap? Oh, he's so cool. Like it was no big deal. That was cool. <laughs> okay, let's head back. Okay, whatever you say, Aaron. Here we go. I guess, I was gonna say, I guess me first, but I guess Aerith first. It looked like she was waiting for me. Are we gonna get some monsters? Yeah. Deal with that. So it's my turn? So it's my turn. I love that. Oh, we're out of MP, so you know what we're gonna use instead? Soul Drain for the first time. Lend me your strength. <laughs> All right, I'm getting it. I'm getting a handle on Aerith's abilities here. Oh, we're silenced, okay. So then we're gonna use the anti-silence. What is secure silence? Echo Mist. This one. Huh? Huh? Woohoo! A canister of hazardous material. Well, you see, Cloud here used to be a soldier. He was? Did you go fight in the war? I might have. He might have. Oh 
I'm guessing there's probably gonna be more baddies coming up here. You sure you wanna fight? Yeah. Look at Aerith just warning them ahead of time. Like, I'll show you what I can do. I don't know if you want to fight me. <sighs> You'll see. That'll do. <laughs> uh, let's go ahead and do another soul drain because we're gonna I'll take that. <laughs> Here it comes. <laughs> Cut. And that soul drain. Literally just got us two MP. Are you for real? I'm gonna crawl Nothing to, to be it. a soldier like you. And that you one only gave us one. To be a soldier, you gotta work at it. Cloud thinks I'm good enough to be one, right? Does Look, soldiering you, really Mr. only Popular. take one MP? That was so cool, you guys. Especially that. Oh, yeah, yeah. It was really cool, and you went like, yeah, yeah. You've got it all wrong. Like that. No way. It was way faster than I that. love this. Yeah, yeah, like that. Fine. Then how about... Yeah, yeah. Ha. Like that. Isn't that right, Cloud? Isn't that right, Cloud? I love that. The kid's just arguing about how he sounded when his, he was battle grunting. It's real cute. <laughs> gonna wish that we did something like that. Yeah. Cause then you have it. Aerith, you're kind of in my way the entire time. Okay. No knowledge. <laughs> Tifa, wait! Tifa! Tifa! Tifa. Tifa? What's wrong? Nothing. Is Tifa like your girlfriend? No. Hmm, but she's someone special. It's not like that. More like... I don't know how to explain. I see. Oh! We're gonna get into trouble! At this point, I think Jesse has asked him if he had someone special, and now Aerith is asking if Tifa is his girlfriend. So I sort of feel like next, Tifa's gonna be like, is Aerith your girlfriend? Because all of the girls just wanna know, Cloud, are you single? <laughs> Even though he is just the worst, he is so, Unavailable. Ladies, don't take an example from this. Don't don't pine after unavailable men. Thank you. From now on, if you run into trouble, promise me you'll find an adult, okay? Okay, I will. Ooh. And here, since you're so cool. You guys are necklace. both grown-ups, but you're also one of us now. You can come and play here whenever you want. That right there, my dearest of friends, is where we have to end today's episode, unfortunately. But don't you worry, there will be more coming soon. I... Just, the more that I play this game, I just love it more and more. Did you get that same experience? Leave a comment and let me know if you did. Don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it. Remember to share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it too. And of course, remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell for Strange Rebel Gaming so you don't miss the next video. Because you wouldn't want that. Trust me, it's a good one. That's all. I love you all.